A young American boy's been having the day of his life in the company of Durham Police. Seven-year-old Ryan Compton received a bone marrow transplant from a Northumberland man more than two years ago. Now he's doing just fine. Peter Lugg met Ryan and his donor Barry Crackett at the Durham Police Dog Training Centre. Right. <laughs> a couple of years on from his bone marrow transplant and little Ryan Compton is fighting fit and ready to have a go at the bad guys. I'd love to be a, a policeman. But why would that be cool? Because it's nice in England. Nice, cool. It's cooler in England. And what do you think about Barry over there? Say my bone marrow. And that's my police radio there. Where we can talk to other policemen when we're riding around on our bike. This was all part of Durham Police's plan to make Ryan feel at home. After all, back in America, his dad is a lawman too. Right now, you know, we're, 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 you know, he's he's alive, he's doing well, you know, he, you know, he's he's doing great, honestly. I mean, he's off all his his meds that that, that help him with the, the, the engraftment, and uh, the only thing he takes now is vitamins every day. You know, and it's amazing. And so, you know, we just we just love every day we're with him. He wants to be a copper like you. Uh, yeah, he, he he's <laughs> he changes every now and then from fireman to cop to NASCAR drivers. Dogs, bikes, and now a helicopter. All credit to Durham Police. I think they've made one young man's day. But on the international database, it was donor Barry who'd proved to be the perfect match. Near the bone marrow, I, th I, thought, I thought the little boy was in the next room or just down the corridor. And then when you find out that he's the other side of the world, it's such a shock. Uh, good shock, though. So if other people are contemplating? Oh, just do it. It's so easy. It's, it's pain-free. Um, and when else are you going to save somebody's life? You know, I'm not a paramedic or anything like that, you know, and I saved some little boy's life. Peter Lug, BBC Look North, Spennymore. Well, I think Ryan might be watching, so hello, Ryan, and hello, the Comptons, from us. Now it's time for sport and a bit of footy, Dawn. Yes, indeed.